All right, so, did you read the blurb about tonight's session? Yes. What's it about? No, no. Bicycles. 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 Bike trails. Bicycles. So actually, Brian here is very kind and brought an actual bicycle. I did pack one in my luggage, but here's a real one. So let me just ask a question first before we even get started, because I've got an actual bike. Um, so, if you ride a bicycle, these pedals move. You actually push the pedals to make it move. Which direction does the pedals go when you, when you move a bike? Round. Excellent. <laughs> Which way round? Clockwise or counterclockwise? They go Widdershins or Deers Hill? Counterclockwise. Your perspective or my perspective? <laughs> For example, if I would actually sit on this bike right now and pedal these pedals, will this pedal be moving forward or backwards as I push the bike along? Backwards. Backwards? Backwards? Yeah. Right to the table. <laughs> All right, so, if, so as you move the spice forward, you'll be pushing the pedals this way, is that right? Yeah. yeah. And you just sort move them. All right, now, here's the question. If I were just to hold this bike so it doesn't actually fall over, I'm putting no force on the bike if I can, just keep it in place. If someone were to come up and push this pedal backwards, which way does the bike actually move? Forward. Yeah. This has nothing to do with tonight, by the way. It's just why I'm thinking of it. There's a bicycle here with the actual pedals. So you said if we push that pedal backwards, the bike will move forwards. The one on side. The one on your side, yeah. Yeah? yeah? Okay, the vocal people are saying yes, but I'm getting an awful lot of funny, squinty looks that are silent. Are there any reasons for no, not backwards? Well, why are you forwards? asking us if it was uh, going to be forwards? Oh, clearly. Uh, just holding so that the bike doesn't fall. Yeah, I'm not, going, I'm not going to put any of the like just light, light touches. Yeah. I'm doing I'm doing nothing to the bike. I'm just stopping it falling over. Yeah, if you push it backwards, it's going to go this way. So if you push the pedal backwards, the bike's going to move forwards. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Now, I think it'll stay still. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we've got three options. It'll put, move backwards, it'll stay still, it'll move forwards. Well, am I standing on the ground when I push it? Yes, 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 yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're floating in space as you push it, yes. <laughs> That's different from standing on the ground. That is true, isn't it? <laughs> Does someone want to come up and try it? Jeannie, you, you should come up and try it. Yeah, yeah, someone get up on top. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> you was if you push that pedal backwards, the bike's going to move forwards. So why why did the bike have to go backwards? What's, I mean, you all said forwards. Well, the vocal people said forwards. Because the only force of being exerted on the whole body of the bike can now tip over in that direction. It's true. If it's like it's just an object, and you push an object backwards, which way does the object have to move? It does actually have to move backwards. There's an object. This, this thing does have to move backwards. But actually, you should really try this at home because the feeling is really weird. So as you push it, you feel this pedal putting it, pushing your hand forwards. It's a really odd feeling. People are just too shy to have to try it right now. Well, we have the cable set up so nobody can actually get through. Which is also awkward. Right. Oh, I've all fixed that in a moment. Don't worry. Just pass the bike around. All right. <laughs> <laughs> 